And the struggles continue offensively for Jordan. Araxi goes around his back and puts it up and in. Trailing by eight points, and the last two buckets have been scored by this man. Bounce pass, Abu Hawass. Are you kidding me? What a play by Jordan Alguari. Design looks good again. Sammy Bullseye. Which is not positive right now. Ibrahim. No, you're exactly right. It just does not look like. Oh! And that's an unsportsmanlike foul on Hussein, who collared. Well. You know what? Haidar going in and scoring. This is just incredible. Haidar transformed. Don't have any stars that are hot in the moment. Ellie Shamoon all hands it off. But look at that! Talk about passing as he goes past. He just needs to focus on the game. The distractions that he creates for himself are unnecessary. Abu Hawass ties it. Maybe I'm guessing he's talking about Ezzedine. I think it's the combo between Gyuk Chan and Ezzedine. Alhar Marche from the right. Oh, how about that? With six and a half minutes remaining. Abu Hawass goes baseline! Well, how many times has he done that in this FIBA Asia Cup? And now the steal. They cannot afford that, and this is where Eldarwitz gets it off the Arlix! That's more like it for the Cedars. Out of the way and get the score. Eldarwitz for three. Bam! Just like that. Lebanon, tie it up. Here he goes again, Araxi. But then he turns it up. No, nope, almost. Yes, he does indeed. And now they pass it up. Here comes Abu Hawass. Oh, he gets blocked by. That tells you everything about him as a player and as a man. And Don Tucker to the rescue once again for Jordan. This tournament overall has been Iraqi. Here he goes. Puts it up and in. Jordan still have time with 11.8 seconds remaining. Step up, that is a huge play. Drags it through, floats it, and it felt like time stood still. He's gonna have to go. The FIBA Asia Cup depends on it. He misses. Abu Hawass gets it. And Lavalon have survived. They have survived. An incredible game against Jordan as the Lebanese pile on top of each other.